to the weekend venture. I feel like I haven't done this in forever, but today we're going on a little adventure. We're taking the dogs to Newlands Forest. I haven't been there in forever as well. So it should be quite cool. And then later on, also might go for a sunset mission. So let's get going. Uh, so let's get going. Yes, Lisa, you ready? So we have finally made it to Newland Forest. This place is super full though, so we had to park quite a while away. The dogs are going crazy because they're super excited. And we don't know how many people are gonna be there with dogs as well, so we'll see what happens. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I'm feeling so tired at the moment. I had a long soccer match yesterday and walking up these hills is very tiring. <laughs> I feel like these cinematic sequences are definitely not as good as my others. It's just because it's so difficult to make nice cinematic stuff in forests because there's so much like contrast and the lights coming through in patches so there's no even lights on the subject that I'm trying to film. So everything just looks very patchy. So sorry about that, but I'm trying my best. This path just keeps going up and up and up all the time. It's meant to be like a round um, circuit of two kilometers and I'm quite far behind right now. Partially due to the fact that I've been taking videos and getting cinematic scenes, uh, but also because I'm really tired. <laughs> so I'm quite a while away from my parents and the dogs. Ugh. It's all about the climb, all about the climb. I've discovered the reason why cinematic sequences don't really work in the forest so here's just a quick tip of the day if any of you want to make cinematic sequences in the forest I think it's always best to have a subject especially in this kind of environment where it is very patchy and contrasty so that there is something to focus on as a main subject so that's just a quick tip of the day because I felt like when I was getting some videos of Leo then it definitely helped to focus the attention on one thing okay yeah. Are you tired? <laughs> Come. So all the dogs are officially dead. De dead tired that is, they're not actually dead. Um, but we are walking back to the car now. Roxy can't even walk anymore so I have to carry her. Leo is just stumbling around everywhere like he's drunk. So it's quite funny. Um, but I am included in that list of dead tired beings. So yeah, gonna go back to the car now, gonna get some lunch then go home, then I think I'm gonna film some tutorial videos and then I might go on a sunset mission later on. Almost there, Leo. <laughs> okay, just some life updates. I have been making another video the whole entire afternoon, which may or may not be released yet. But it's a very special video that you guys have been asking for for a year, for a year already. So it's finally here and I'm really excited to share it with you guys. On another note though, my friend Eden Dalport, who we haven't seen in forever, we're going on a sunset mission to Lagoon Beach, which we also haven't been to in forever. So that's gonna be fun. And hopefully it's a good sunset because yesterday was a banger and I missed it for the weekend match here. But if you follow me on Instagram, you would have seen on my Instagram story how amazing it was. But that would have been last week on my Instagram story. So yeah, anyway, leaving for the beach now. What's up? What's up, Rui? Right. I haven't seen you in ages. It's been, uh, it's been quite a while, eh? How you doing? You're kidding me, my man. All good. Well, that was an almost awkward handshake. That was almost, so we got it. It's fine.
So we have made it onto the beach. Aiden's found, found a new toy. Uh, is that a tire? What is that? Yeah, <laughs> Anyway, uh, doing some meditation on the beach. I kind of forgot to update you guys on what's happening, but we've just been taking some photos and getting some cinematic scenes. Aiden's doing some amazing cinematic walking, so that's always good. Yeah, so and jazz. yeah, we got Table Mountain here. He's always cool. And the sea and the sun and everything just, yeah, keeps on. Anyway, we're walking to the rail tracks now, like just over there. I've never been there before, so should be cool. It's not a true mission if you don't get your pants wet. <laughs> made it onto the train tracks and ow, there's just sharp rocks everywhere here but pretty cool view in the background gonna get some bangers here what do you, what do you say bangers okay we're doing the same the same thing And that is the sunset. The sun's kind of gone behind a massive fog bank so it didn't really light up as much as we were expecting it to. Also the clouds on top of the mountain just disappeared so that's that's not great. But we still got really cool pictures. You probably saw in the thumbnail the pretty cool like handstand shot that we got. Well not handstand, hanging. Hanging shots definitely. Um, but anyway, heading back to the car now. So this crazy red line just pops out in the sky now. Somebody getting in the bang of shots there. What is happening? Look at this. Good, missing the handle there. Good, the door's not unlocked yet. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> I missed the handle and then the door was locked. It was me looking through like the um, thing yeah. like... <laughs> can't, can't do it. <laughs> you, you better drop the tunes now. Oh yeah, Bruce, let's get some bangers. You better drop it so hard. I thought I'm walking home. We got bangers out there now. We're gonna have even more bangers in here. You better. You better produce now. It's time to produce. The awkward goodbye. Yeah, definitely not planned. Yeah, cheers. See, oh, cheers, man. See, so see you soon. Good. It was a good mission. <laughs> Check your eye, bro. Cool. <laughs> see you, man. <laughs> 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 <laughs>